Hi, welcome back. This week is a fat burning week. That means we are going to drain the fat from our tummy as much as possible. If you have not watched my previous video about the CBT as well as the exercise, consider watching it now to understand how fat is bad for your organs and how to drain them. My name is Dr. Chitra. I'm one of the GPs working near London. I'm also a certified partner in the National Weight Loss Program. Okay, this week I am approaching with intermittent fasting with a very low carb diet. That means the carbohydrate is only 20 to 50 grams per day. You must know what is the science behind food and the energy. So you have a better understanding how to manage your weight and drain the fat from your tummy. When you eat food, a hormone called insulin produced in our body, that insulin break down the carbohydrate and give you energy to continue your everyday activity. But if you have more sugar in your body, this extra sugar will be converted into fat. Insulin deposit this fat in and around the organs. Of course, insulin is very good to maintain your blood sugar level in the body, but it is very bad if you have excess sugar because it converts that to fat and deposit around the organs. This is the main reason when a diabetic person start an insulin treatment, they put on weight very quickly because this excess insulin convert all the extra calories into fat and deposit in the body. So this is the basic concept of food into energy. Now we are going to see how are we going to drain this fat. We are going to reverse the process by stopping or reducing the insulin production from your body. It is very simple. If you don't have any carbohydrate in your food, there is no insulin protection. But still your body need energy to continue its activity. So our body will start breaking down the fat from its storage and utilize that energy. When the fat is broken down, it produces a chemical called ketone that will send our body to ketosis mode. This ketosis is really good because it reduces your appetite at the same time it increases your fat burning very quickly. So we are going to achieve ketosis with the help of stopping the insulin by eating very low carbohydrate diet and making us to fast. Okay, now we will talk about intermittent fasting. 16 is to 8 is the popular way of doing a intermittent fasting. That means you are going to fast for 16 hours and eat only for 8 hours time. During the fasting period, you can drink plenty of water, black coffee or herbal tea. Don't worry, it's very simple. For example, if you finish your dinner at 7 p.m. and start your breakfast at 9 a.m., instead of 9 a.m., push that to 11 a.m. so that you are starting your day with a brunch and having a fasting for 16 hours. You can eat between 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. and fast for 16 hours after that. This is a very simple and effective way to start your fat burning. The more challenging way of intermittent fasting is one meal a day. That means you are going to eat only one meal per day and rest of the day you are going to fast. Fasting is very effective to bring your body to ketosis. So I have taken this intermittent fasting approach. So I used 16 is to 8 as well as one meal a day in alternative days for the whole one week time. The next thing I took only 800 calories during this intermittent fasting days for the last one week time. That is not that difficult, especially when you are doing an intermittent fasting, your food intake is reduced and your calorie intake will also go down. I limited my carbohydrate between 20 to 50 grams per day. At the same time, this carbohydrate is only from the vegetables. All these vegetables grow above the ground because they have very low carbohydrate. This is my diet plan just to see how easy to plan this diet. It took about only two minutes for me to write down what I'm planning to eat. Then I ordered all the groceries online so that I am not tempted to buy something in the supermarket. You can eat any meat and any salad but make sure your calorie intake is less than 800 calories. At the same time your carbohydrate is less than 50 grams per day. Make sure the carbohydrate comes only from the vegetable which grows above the ground. I was unable to show some of my lovely meal which you can make it in within few minutes time but I will definitely show in the next week how to make a very delicious Indian meal in less than 10 minutes time. Before I end this video, I want to insist only one point. Please have time to plan for your diet as well as the exercise. If you have already planned, there are very less chance you go wrong. All the best for your journey. I'll see you next week.
Take care. Bye.